Hi everyone, uh, just wanted to share a new pack that I'm working on. I have started modeling uh, some unique elements here and some props. And I basically focused on a different style compared to the other ones that I was working on. And this particular asset pack will be mainly focusing on modularity and also detail. So I am actually adding a ton of detail to these models and also making uh, certain custom textures that will really allow these models to showcase a lot of really good weathering and sort of distressed textures. And uh, and again, I've started actually uh, this weekend and I have some props that I made and these are really just simple to populate the scene, but let's jump into Unreal Engine and I'll show you guys uh, what this scene looks like so far. Okay, so we're on Unreal Engine and I also wanted to be able to go in and add my second creation for the meta human. And I've also wanted to add that to the scene, so I'll just play from here. I basically created a small map where I do most of my development. So I usually check all the meshes, uh, do some basic, very, very simple lighting. And you can see that it gives you an idea really to see the space. It's kind of like a block out that I'm doing with these modular meshes that I'm building. Some temporary platforms here, there's some boxes. Uh, I know there is... Uh, some changes that I will make because the shadows are creating these odd triangles on the models. I know there's a really good fix for it, but I just wanted to share this. And if any of you are interested in this pack, please comment below. This will be done within the next probably couple of weeks. And it will be kind of like a sci-fi station. Uh, there is going to be many different walls that you can modulate. Uh, in your scene. Uh, I will also have doors that will open and I will animate them uh, and create some simple blueprints. So if you guys were to download this pack, you can actually build a level. The meshes are not extremely detailed, but there is enough detail for you to be able to actually have really, really good detail in all the little nano stuff that I'm adding in here. So there's ton of ton of detail in these meshes. And I will also include some characters, some basic like stand-in characters, but I'll go back to my detail lighting, uh, show you guys again. Um, and I'll just go, why don't I do my stats for the FPS. And I'll just start playing from here again so here I basically while I'm working on my scene I always create this sort of uh, section uh, where I can focus on different things whether I'm actually uh, going to change some of the lighting or I am going to test some of my textures so in this case I actually created a, a meta human this is the second one that I have and I really wanted to be able to uh, start using the control rig. So I've actually done that uh, with these and I'm just gonna go back to my lit mode, play from here and show you guys how good these meta humans look like. So here is Vivian. Uh, I basically created her a while back and I also wanted to add some elements. There's like a a temp backpack uh, mesh that I put back there. So I'm gonna actually try to use Marvelous Designer to maybe create some clothing for her. So I'm testing very different colors and lights and also the interaction of these lights uh, because I will actually include this map once I finish detailing this map. So whenever you purchase this pack, 
it will also come with that so let me also show you guys some work in progress textures so here is uh, the same door that you saw there uh, which is very low specular uh, information I didn't want to go too high in the reflections but this is uh, let me zoom in actually so you guys can see what it looks like and this was all done in substance painter really simple then I have this guy I will probably include this guy in the pack I just need to add some eyes to him uh, and he's basically a character that I worked on in ZBrush and again I'll just basically uh, open up another map and show you guys where I am actually uh, again testing mainly testing um, textures so let's do save on this so here again just a very simple scene and this is how I t test most of my files uh, and again these are the doors that I'm working on and I'm going to actually animate some of these doors so I'm just basically really looking for scale and I put in a lot of detail uh, in the texturing process again so these meshes really have good details and um, the floors are temp uh, you know this is all temp stuff for me to be able to see it but this is what the pack will look like this is kind of like an early preview that I wanted to do for this pack uh, while I'm working on it and I will probably finish this um, with the additional assets that I'm actually building uh, I have a couple more walls and then I am going to animate this door so I'm gonna have this part probably come up I want to I want to do a couple different things so it looks really unique so I'll probably have like a different uh, sort of timeline on how these are activated uh, and then maybe a panel to open them up and obviously these guys will go down and open so again just wanted to uh, share a work in progress file I am doing all my modeling in um, plasticity I'm also using blender and I'm also taking advantage of Houdini for certain things so I will basically try to do some uh, more props I've done some cables here some very simple cables and um, if you have any questions leave your comments and again I'll probably have an update video on this file and hope you guys like this so far and if you have any questions please comment below thank you